Hey, how you doing today? My name is Brilliant. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today, we are jumping back into Rusted Moss, and I want to show you where to go. If you feel like you're getting a little bit stuck, you've gotten the you've gotten the grenade, you've gotten the grapple, you've got a way to, to, to jump up super high. These are all requirements for where we are about to go next. If your map looks anything like mine, as in you've only been following the tutorials and you're not exploring, make sure you're exploring all of the little open nooks and crannies because there are tons of upgrades all over the place and you should probably have some more health some more magic uh some more trinkets uh, i didn't even buy anything from the store other than uh, the magnet at this point go go get some upgrades that's probably what you should do before you get to here but if you if you just if you're like yo yo come on let's let's just get to it well then uh let's just get to it so from here up on the map we just got our grenades. We're going to head over to the right. Grenade this door open. You, you, you've probably done that. And then we're going to make our way up. And in this whole area, we're going to be making a great use of the wind over and over and over again. So we're going to make our way up. And right here, grenade this. Always hit those saves. I'm going to say it over and over again. So like, like a broken record. We gotta we gotta use this wind to make a, a big jump over. Just like that. There we go. Some enemies, you know, you, you, we don't we don't have to fight this enemy. We don't we don't have to do this. I don't I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. Alright, I think the easiest way to do this is to jump up just before the wind gets there. And then grab onto that. Three, two, one, and ciao! Easy. Hook this again just before the wind. Get up here. Look at that. Nice big high jump. That's what we're looking to do. Get us another save. And then now we're going to be going to the left. Again, whenever the wind is going, you can just duck. And then that will stop the wind. Ooh. I think the damage actually just saved me from falling off there. That was kind of nice. Again, you can you don't have to fight these guys. You should. You should go for the money. Oops. You gotta you gotta get on there just a little bit further to the left. There we go. Ooh, almost hit the spikes, but not today. So right here is kind of a funky jump. There's actually something else up top that you can kinda get to, but it's not even worth doing until you get an upgrade that makes that jump a lot easier. Let's just put it that way. There we go. Just like that. We don't need the wind in this area. We can get through just fine without it. There we go. Another teleporter. Another save. And I think, if I remember right, if we go down... There we go. Open up the backtracking while we're here. You know? Oh, don't shoot these things. If you shoot these things, they get angry at you. And then they come attack you. So, so don't do that. The game will end up trying to use these things against you, which is uh, unfortunate. Because uh, they're kind of cool in their own way. There we go. Make our way across. And so I haven't been showing off the map very much. We just made our way up and around. So now we're going to be fighting the wind in some of these areas. And in areas like this, it's almost better to, to not fight your enemies because Especially this guy. Oh my gosh. If you fight that little guy right there, he will make your life so tough. There we go. I got lucky. I wasn't expecting... I thought I was going to have to jump up on that again. All right. So in this next room, hopefully you've got some health because it's a little fight area. Oh. Get some health. Jump out of the way. Uh oh. Ooh, just barely dodged that missed me so essentially the the, the play there is to just kind of go back and forth between the two enemies as you're going so you don't accidentally shoot these little guys as you're as you're going Ooh! so i just grappled that thing down into here oh no got me again remember if you die right now you go all the way back to the last the last checkpoint which is a ways away. So be very careful that you don't die in this room. So this one's kind of a funky jump. Come up here. Jump around. Oop. You actually don't want to get the wind on this yet. Get onto here. 
And then on the next wind, catch the one right above you. Oop. There you go. You just need the you need your grapple to be just a little bit longer. Leave that guy be. He's fine. You don't need the money that bad. So now we're gonna be going to the left. And right here, if you've got any battle trinkets, you want to make sure your battle trinkets are on because we are in for a boss fight. And this one is not easy, I tell you what. I gotta get through all the all the dialogue though. She says, You're bad. I'm like, nah, fam. So every every time it just goes back and forth. It does those the attack from above and then the attack from the side. I suggest early on throwing out your grenades. And just try not to take like this. It's it's actually a fairly tough fight. Uh oh, very easy at caught off guard. Here you got to make sure that you you know to duck. Once she goes into phase two, she almost always gets a, a hit off, and then you can only duck on the grass. All right. So once we get to the third phase, she's got no contact damage. So don't worry about her. Stay right underneath her, and then just worry about the swords coming through. One, two, those three, and then shoot her here, then those three, and then get back close to her. And the third phase is the easiest if you just don't freak out that she's got a giant sword. First try when I got to the third phase. Easy. That's the easiest part. And then you get the next Tatiana's piece. Just like that. Nice and easy. This is the way to go. Not gonna lie, that was tough. That's why at the beginning of the video I said you want to have lots of upgrades don't like if you're rushing to this you're not gonna have as much health and uh magic power and uh it, it's gonna make the fight just that much harder so anyways i hope that you enjoyed this video i hope that some of the what i was doing during the boss fight that helped you figure out where to go next thank you so much to my members i really really appreciate you for supporting the channel i appreciate you for watching the video at the end again my name is relia and i'll talk to you again more real soon thanks bye